Recently, I had a podcast where me and Poob tore apart Diablo 4 and said some really unsavory things. Playing it, and I was pretty disappointed and uninterested. And then I talked to you on the phone, and, and you were like, oh, it actually sucks more than you thought. This is the biggest piece of shit game ever. And so I was like, fuck this game. Like, this game sucks. I'm willing to admit that I was wrong, and I was foolish. I think I should issue an apology. Because Diablo 4 kind of rocks. So from the bottom of my heart. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Oh, Jesus Christ. Diablo has always had a special place in my heart. You know, I grew up playing Diablo 1 and 2. Diablo 2 is what taught me how to type. Yeah, they didn't have no auction houses in that game. So when you went into a trading room, you had to be fast, fast, fast. Think 1980s Wall Street, except for instead of selling nerd shit, like commodities or whatever, index funds and stuff, we're selling manly shit. Enigmas, torches. We didn't have cufflinks on, suspenders. We dressed like men. We had icks. Maybe Saigons on the weekends. Diablo 2 was sacred to me. It is, it's a place of nostalgia for me. And so I was poised to be hypercritical of anything that was changed in Diablo 4. I mean, you remember how Diablo 3 turned out, right? <laughs> I'm telling you guys, dude, the high, I still got battle scars from my, my D3 hype. I do realize, by the way, that Blizzard completely remastered D2 uh, because they knew that the people that like D2 would be really critical of D4. So they were like, uh -huh, you're gonna complain about D4? Well, here's D2 remastered so you can shut up. I get that, I get that, all right? Bravo to them, they, they read the room and they knew what we wanted. Uh, but, not gonna keep me from talking shit. A lot of what made people immediately turned off about D3 was the insane tonal shift between D2 and D3. I played D2 and I would sit there and just be appalled by like the amount of gore in that game. There would, there would be like tusks coming out the walls and then there would be people fucking meat hooked onto them. And it was just such a gory game. I'm gonna get this thing so I have something to put my foot on. Uh, hey, come here, Tiger, I got something to tell you. Blizzard had fired Blizzard North, the developers of D2, as soon as D2 was finished, because they had to make World of Warcraft. Now, I know World of Warcraft is beloved by many. Everybody loves it. But to me, <laughs> I, I hate it. I hate it more than anything, okay? And people that play World of Warcraft, <laughs> they deserve new merch on the Shekel Scheme, guys. Come check it out. Christmas is only six months away. Buy this for your dad. Buy it for buy it for your mom. I don't give a shit. Buy it. Look at the first advertisement for the uh, for D3 with the monk. It came out in like 2008. Oh, doesn't that look like World of Warcraft to you? What'd they do to my fucking game, dude? They heard the masses this time. Diablo 4 has the tone down pat. It's gritty. It's depressing. It's bleak. It's disgusting. They did a really good job of like making the world seem alive. Like people aren't just waiting on you. There's other things happening. There's other NPCs that are traveling around. There's, there's stuff happening out there. It's cool. This guy's just out here naked with a fucking bow and a pair of sandals. Yeah, yeah. They oh, this guy. Up. The, yeah, the, this is the most dangerous job. I'm just gonna follow this guy. I gotta see what this guy's up to. Oh, he's gonna take on uh, 17 spiders and four snakes. <laughs> he's punching them. He's not even like. It never ends well, dude. It never ends well. Yeah. If my mom asked me to go hunting out here, I'd fucking tell her to go kill herself. Yeah, good. Some of the environments are fucking beautiful. They're using, you know, they're not using it to its maximum potential, but uh, they're definitely trying a little bit more with elevation and stuff like that. It's a very vertical game considering it's isometric. Whoa, look at this descent. This is wacky. This is badass. Oh, look, we're at the beach. He's like Path of Exile. Yeah. Oh I wonder if there's dead babies on the shore like Path of Exile. Mm. What if like to one up 
Path of Exile, they do like four dead babies, like a little pile. <laughs> of dead babies. It spells out Path of Exile sucks in dead babies. Yeah. yeah. They sit down with the programmers and like, what the fuck is this? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> we cannot publish this evening. <laughs> 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 Why not? But, but Path of Exile put a dead baby in. <laughs> yeah, so a... we were gonna put four dead babies. <laughs> Path of Exile makes no fucking money. We're fucking Blizzard. <laughs> keep that shit out of the games. You molest people on the side, but you keep these <laughs> games clean. The cutscenes in this game rock. Okay, uh, I am a huge fan of the cutscenes. In Diablo 2, I used to watch those things clapping my hands like an idiot. That was my Marvel experience. You know how many times I sat there and watched uh, Tyrael throw his sword into the World Stone? And I had to, you know, I didn't have headphones back then, so I had my Hewitt Packard speakers cranked all the way to 11. Fucking hated me. Well, dude, D D4's cutscenes, they live up to it. The story has gotten convoluted and stupid, and I don't really care about it a whole lot, but uh, that doesn't really matter when it looks this good. There's definitely some uh, some scenes in the, these cutscenes that are just, they're just pretty. It's just pretty, it's pretty stuff. What? I was in the middle of watching that. Wait, Who did, skipped it? Wait, Frog, did you skip uh, that? And it like my <laughs> apologies. Last <laughs> you, you son of a bitch. Uh, my bad, man. <laughs> By the way, this is a little sideway. Uh, I do think they did an excellent job with Diablo 2 Resurrected. Uh, they remastered all the cutscenes. Uh, all of them are great except for Act 1. Uh, Act 1, this is the original, by the way, and you can clearly tell that this waiter is... um. Yeah, he's a he's a, a little person or whatever they want to be called. He's a little he's, he's a dwarf guy, and in the remaster, this is the remaster right here. He's just a regular guy. They have stripped our short king out of the game, and I immediately noticed this uh, when later in the cinematic he dies. Why would that be the moment that I remember? Well, because in the original one he looks like this. You can't tell me that's not funny, dude. <laughs> he's, like, he's waving his hands around and shit. <laughs> why, would they, why would they replace this dude? This guy fucking rocks. No, there's a thing where they were like, and Dario's still alive in one of the cutscenes. And I said, hey, I, I'm willing to bet $4 that we're going to fight in Dario at some point. Yeah, they, uh, they cover her tits. With like scar oh, what, what the, the fuck? fuck? Oh, you big and bad, huh? You evil, but you you scared to show your nipples? I found a guillotine you can lop someone's head off with. There's a rack that you can pull and it literally tears a person apart. Entrails falling down onto the floor. Peel back the skin or rip the legs. But don't show a nipple, dude. Come on, that is disgusting. <laughs> don't you have any fucking decency? What's wrong with you? Yeah, maybe next time you can use your bull butt to distract me. No legendaries? Are you serious? Yeah. Oh, oh, oh there, there we go. go. There, there it is. is. Yeah. Okay. Wait, these guys were just in here doing the Avengers pose the entire time. Yeah, they're in there, but Lorath was in here just bracing for impact for fucking 12 minutes. Is Andariel gone? Is our is Andariel gone? They weren't even looking out the door. They were just yeah. sitting in there looking amongst themselves. She gone? Yeah, she gone out there. There's, they had a straight view of her burning to death. They could have seen that. You didn't see the 25 foot tall woman burning to death out there? Screaming and chaining they were, they were doing their Ginsu force pose or whatever those people were called. We were talking about them.
<laughs> I do just want to mention that the rest of this video does not have any more analysis. This is like, this is just funny moments from the game, us enjoying it, us talking about the game as we're playing it. Um, but I also did just get this picture texted to me, uh, and I wanted to show you guys. Even Obama himself really enjoys my coffee cup. All right, so go to shekelscheme.com and pick one up. I talked to Laura. I think he's stroking a donkey's cock. Eddie. He's got his hand under there, dude. I just watched him. I know why he's dying. They put spikes on the inside of the armor. I'd take those right off if that was mine. There was a flaw in the design. Uh, blacksmith, I should have put the spikes on the outside. Oh, this is that badass boss I was talking about. Oh. This guy's evil as hell, dude. It's like a teenager made like the most badass <laughs> boss you could think of. Yeah. Oh, we just moved. Oh, look, this lady's on fire. <laughs> These guys are all trying. You got to give them credit. What's stupid is we can't actually use the villagers' dead bodies to like summon skeletons. Because I know there's goddamn skeleton in there. <clears throat> I know you got bones in your boy. Yeah. <laughs> Acting like you ain't got bones. I know you got bones. <laughs> what is up, my necro? <laughs> necro. Just basically the N word. <laughs> I'm a necromancer. What's a necro gotta do to get a legendary, man? You know what I'm saying? <laughs> I know. No, like if I have a like a stack of chipped uh, amethyst, and then I go to the gym lady and I go upgrade all my amethyst, combine them to make like a better grade one. It then takes them out of my stash and puts them right in my fucking pocket. <laughs> you just know there was one intern that was responsible for handling gems. In the yeah, upgrade. if I met him IRL, I'd fucking kill him. I just I'd grab him by his fucking ears and I'd get in his face and I'd say, "Do, do you even think?" Do you think before you do shit? I would casually explain why I'm mad at him. And I would I would put him at ease though with how slow and how quiet I was talking. And then I would quickly, uh -huh. while he's so relaxed, I would quickly turn his head around backwards. <laughs> Putting him at ease. So quick, he's still sitting in his chair, his head's just fucking backwards. I'd pull out my really sharp katana and light him. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Nothing I reach the as a as I'm walking out the room, resheathing it, that's when he falls. No, no, no. When you shut the door, you do like the gentle <laughs> slam, then he falls over in his chair. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> why, why are we killing this guy again? Oh, yeah, the I, gyms. The gyms. Yeah, yeah the gyms. He, you know, like those shrines that turn you into a ball of electricity? Yo, yeah. I got one of those, and I went through like a little camp up here, and I'm pretty sure there's just like a little chihuahua that's not even like an enemy, and I just fucking zapped it to death. Oh my it god. Just, it just got <laughs> obliterated the second I went up to it. You guys sharpening a fucking like rock. What are you doing? Make oh. sure me, gotta make sure me rock sharp. Oh, never mind. He's sharpening the knife. That makes a lot more sense. <laughs> yeah, he's yeah, using, the, like, oh, he's wait, using his blade to sharpen that rock. It looks like this <laughs> guy's whittling it. That's why I was like, what the fuck? This guy's what? different. <laughs> Threw it down, not sharp enough. <laughs> that that right. thing will never get sharp. <laughs> it's useless. Turbo Fart Man, good to have you amongst our ranks. Uh, it's a pleasure to be here. I know Lilith's demons will quake in fear when they see the three of us. Oh, come explosion! I see you're about to start a foul under crypt quest. <laughs> I think I will join you. I'm a pit mommy. Yeah. <laughs> My beautiful pity they would never hurt anyone. <laughs> Dude. Meanwhile they're toddlers. <laughs> yeah, they <probably> <laughs> <laughs> After all these years, this is the best you can do. I don't know, man. You are getting fucked up. Yeah. Like, this guy's talking a lot of shit for a dude that is getting absolutely beat up on on his stoop. Yeah. Stoop kid won't leave his stoop. We roll up with fucking, fucking bows. Yeah, he's just fucking <laughs> ripping up a new asshole. Yeah. <laughs> Two dudes rolling up, shooting a thousand arrows yeah, at a time. Stabbing, I'm stabbing him to death. It's yeah. like 80 knives. Knifing him in the throat. Oh, what, you got a demon? Yeah, trip him. <laughs> trip him with that bomb. <laughs> we'll stab him too. I don't give a shit. Oh, hey, we're Dude, fighting him. This guy again. All right, I'm. how many times you got to teach you this old man? <laughs> There's a crazy supplicant we have to kill. I would hate yeah. that to be the name that I die under, my job title. 
A crazed supplicant? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Died in the line of duty. <laughs> crazed supplicant. What'd you do? I just kind of like chanted or something yeah, I was, for this I was like, <laughs> old guy. <laughs> <laughs> I was like really fanatical. It was like, yeah. My oh, job I, to take this shit super seriously. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, I'm like a mega fan. I like cheered for him while he, I got stabbed to death. <laughs> <And> then... <laughs> oh my god, I wonder who's here. Oh, it's, <laughs> it's oh, the great. fucking old man. <laughs> Dude, uh, Lorath is giving this guy what for. Like, he's really been yeah. in there. We gotta give him some ups. This guy is not a pussy. Okay, no loot. There's gonna be a fifth Elias. Yeah. Here it is. Here it is. The sightless eye. Oh, this guy's not even out of breath. We've just been fighting non-stop for 11 minutes. <laughs> yeah. yeah, there, there it is. is. <laughs> the most relaxed <laughs> motherfucker. <laughs> just swinging his, Bro, just swinging his big machete on a stick. I like a like, madman for like 12 yeah. minutes. I just did a thousand reps with this fucking dagger. You're fucking... Yeah, there it is. Huh. See, come on. Let's just put this on the thing, because I realize we're in the it's middle risky. of nowhere. Yeah. But we haven't got a choice. It's risky. We don't got a choice, Picture man. We got to progress. Yeah, it's risky. We don't have a choice. But I have a pre-made pedestal and stand that this goes on. <laughs> yeah. It's risky, but I. Oh, thank God! I'm actually really prepared for this. <laughs> yeah. It's like a custom-made pedestal right for this thing. Think. 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 Did it actually work? Yeah, that's what I do. Push it. Over. There's a full essay on there. What are you writing? <laughs> what are you, what Starts writing raps, like rhymes. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> These bars stink. Scribbity, dibbity, dibbity. Skibbity, boop, bop. Do not, do Here, give it. Yo, and this is. <laughs> <laughs> What the fuck are you guys on about? <laughs> we're about to go fucking. We're about to go give us our record label. <laughs> oh, dude, he's still thinking about it. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <coughs> Hot bars, fresh out the presses. We gotta go deliver it to the. Yeah, the yeah deliver it to those barbarians in the north. <laughs> yeah. They'll love this shit. <laughs> Uh, you know, this, these are some fire ass <laughs> bars from the deep desert, man. These are gonna. <laughs> All those desert people, they always got rhythm, you yeah. know? Not like us <laughs> barbarians up here. <laughs> these desert beats. These are some fire rhymes you've yeah. delivered. Oh, I have a letter for you, Donan. Read this shit. Yeah, well, I haven't seen something this good since Yay. I'm gonna hit him with my final form. Are you ready? Uh, I'm ready. Question is, is he? Yeah, 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 yeah. It actually did a lot of damage. Yeah, that was actually pretty <laughs> cool. I was expecting it to be super fucking lame. No, that was badass. I don't do lame shit, dude. I actually signed. Uh, like, I'm not doing any more lame shit for the rest of my life. <laughs> I made that proclamation at the beginning of this year. You're gonna become cool. Yep, I'm just cool now. Did I, did I not tell you guys? What? I'm well, cool kinda now. Just I'm just cool he kind of gave off like way cooler energy. So. Yeah, I actually got a pair of sunglasses. I put those on sometimes. Oh, man. This, this that is actually cool. really cool. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. How do you take shits now? Me? Yeah. Uh. Yeah. Do you still use that fucking gay ass stool? Because if so, you are not no, cool, dude. I I just prop one leg up on the bowl. Ah uh, shit! Okay. <laughs> <laughs> and, and I pop my collar. <laughs> And I let it pop out. That's, that's tight. <laughs> I'm trying to think of how that would look. Badass. Look that's badass. all you need to know. Yeah. <laughs> Whoa, it's the three people that I've talked to independently all over the map. They're all in one <laughs> little room now. Yeah. Uh, this is, I bet you there's some people that were just like clapping like a fucking idiot during this scene. It's like the fucking Avengers. Uh, babe, not real Laura, and John and all together, babe. Here's the eye. I know what happened the last time the eye was used. I know it didn't end well. Do you have a better Something idea? Despawn. Any of you? Yeah, the column hey, despawn. That really I have a feeling that's gonna attack him, considering hey. there's oh. no column there. Oh. 
What did you get fucked up more while we were gone? <laughs> <laughs> the same the same pillar skeleton beat him up like five yeah. times over. <laughs> I think I'll lay next to this one. <laughs> <laughs> they kept having to hold him back. He's like, I'm serious, I'm gonna fuck that thing up. He keeps walking into it. Yeah. He, he doesn't know when to stop. The wall things beat him up like seven times. Like, I think on, we man. should call the fight, Donan. <laughs> Donan, I don't think you should go back again. Fuck it, man. I know his moves now. Yeah. <laughs> he just has one arm. I think I can. <laughs> <laughs> got him beat. Wait, oh Frog, can you do like a absolute peasant British accent? <laughs> Good job. This guy's a natural. <laughs> oh my uh, god. Like the most far <laughs> man. <kind of laughs> <All right. laughs> I, I honestly used to do that same fucking joke to my wife all the time. <laughs> She sound really British? <laughs> no, 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 not like as a Brit way. I'd be like, hey, can you do your best, like, dumbass impression? And then uh -oh. the next thing she'd say, I'd be like, dude, that was outstanding. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know why. Like, a dude would think that's funny for some reason that just infuriates women. They do not, they, they don't even get a giggle out of it. That didn't even make a giggle. That shit's funny, dude. <laughs> Hey, bitch, you're retarded. <laughs> yeah, bitch, why are you not laughing? Oh, you don't find that funny? <laughs> <laughs> you stupid whore. <laughs> that do take a fucking joke. <laughs> yeah, basically, like, come on, man. <laughs> it's funny. Sometimes it's best to keep your mouth closed, you see. So here's a toast to your best friend.